Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you conductivity of each liquid in detail. So we have a bunch of liquids beginning with water, then liquid hand wash, then distilled water, salt water, then finally coconut oil. I just made a random circuit and when the light blinks, the circuit is complete then it conducts electricity. If the LED bulb is dim then which means it's less conductive and if it's more brighter it's more conductive. If it's now blinking then it's non-conductive. So let's get started. First I pour some liquid hand wash and it was well conducting. Then the second one is distilled water and distilled water means it only contains hydrogen and oxygen. Actually it conducts a little bit but it stresses more. When the cables contact each other the light intensity is high so which means it conducts electricity but it's not a pure conductor like water, it stresses more. Distal water made by distillation of water which means water made into vapor and cooled into water. Then I just added some salt into the water then let's see what happens. When I added salt into that, the conductivity increases. So some sort of impurities will increase the conductivity of distilled water because it changes the texture of the water and adding more elements to that. So it become more conductive. Then I added some water color into that. Eventually it made more conductive. Then I tried the thing we all use every day that's still water. Still water is a well conductor of electricity. Then the final thing was homemade coconut oil is 100% pure and let's check it out what happens. It doesn't even conduct actually a little bit but when the wires come into contact it blinks so which means coconut oil is non-conductive. Actually, it's more concentrated and it's different in texture compared with other liquids we use. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you wish, you can subscribe. So see you next time. Bye.